It's about gathering that intelligence, interviewing uh, the crew on board, uh, and 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 basis, basically even the the logistical aspect of going safely on board, um, separating the crew members, uh, interviewing them separately, and just making sure that they none of them are involved. And if they are, then if we do have the 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 reasonable reasonable grounds to suspect, then of course there would be a, an arrest sure, happening. But, but but you did let them go on this occasion. And when we posted the story on Facebook last night uh, on our Facebook page, uh, one of our uh, followers, Miguel, said, uh, "Hopefully the destruction of the drug is complete and none is lost in the local market channels. The vessel should have been arrested." Can you address those two points, please? Well, in terms of uh, the destruction of drugs, that is also part of the procedure, and we have systems in place so that those drugs can be destroyed safely, and that, of course, I understand the public consent that none of it goes amiss. That is that is understandable. But we do have a number of officers that are present there. They witness each other and, and witness the destruction of those drugs. And we do also have independent uh, officers being there. So we do okay. have an RGP officer and indeed an, an environmental officer to make sure that these drugs are correctly disposed of.